Hey guys, six months here in the basement and just can't believe that we are half a year into COVID and working from home. And now that we've got this house construction going, I have to say there's a lot less uh, time with the Danes because while I'm in the basement, I've got contractors on the first floor and the second floor and oftentimes they need to get down here into the basement. So the Danes are spending a lot of time in their uh, dog room, their stalls. Wimpy little gooch, don't you see? The great big dog's the only one for me. Then I'll be doing all right. Well, I got him back when he was just a pup. Way back then, I could pick him up. Now he barely fits into my pickup truck. Yeah, that's what it is. Doing all right. Magic's gone sweet. And it's a great day. just got home from a nice long 75 mile ride. It's three o'clock and I'm trying to figure out, has Magic had lunch? Did you eat? Did he eat? You have not had lunch. Do you want to eat? You want to eat? You're not even chatting. Do you want to eat? Okay, you're going to start drooling, aren't you? Only one scoop. One scoop. Pro plan. Shredded chicken. Okay, there you go. Mm. Dig in, buddy. Yes. So patient. Of course, you've seen the dog stalls. If you've watched, these have been just fantastic, particularly with the construction. Finn! Come, Finn! Come on! Come here! There he is! Hi! Come on! Come on! Good. I'll give you some food. Go in your house. Go ahead and eat. You're a good boy. Eat your lunch. That's lunch. You don't have to. You can come out if you want. Okay. Good boy. Oh, good job, Magic. Do you want to go outside? You want to go outside? Magic, come on. You want to go out, Magic? Come on. Who wants to go outside? Out. Finn, go on. Go on. Call Finn. Finn. Go on. Why does your face look so troubled? You're not in trouble. You want to go outside? <laughs> go outside. Magic, come. Come on. Magic, you go outside. Magic will not go outside if he thinks Finn's going to come out there. Um, I've taken them out for walks at lunch and everything, but there's drywall dust everywhere and it's really just a challenge. So um, it'll be an interesting next five weeks, but it'll go so fast like the last six months have gone. And just wanted to thank you for tuning into the Great Dane channel. And, you know, 18,000 subscribers now. Never would have thought this is where this channel would go. And I'm really struggling a little bit to say the content that makes sense or is interesting to you. So. Um, I'm loving all the Dane owners and just dog lovers who tune in. Keep me uh, posted on your pets as well as any questions you might have. And I tell you what, I am missing having the dogs down here because they're just so comforted when they're laying here with me. But for now, I'll just keep working and keep you guys updated. So thanks for tuning in. Okay guys, so a lot of you know I work for Nestle which owns Purina, which is the pro plan that I feed the dogs. Well, we also have Fancy Feast, and I'm going to feed that to the kittens right now, and I've got five or six different flavors. I'm going to document which ones they like and don't like so I know which ones to buy. So here we go. This is Fancy Feast Turkey Feast in Gravy Grilled. Let's see how they like it.
There it is. Ooh, how did we like it? Eat your turkey feast. Come on. Here, kitty. Go on. Lie down, Maggie. Go on. All right, I turned off the light. Maybe she'll use that as camouflage to get over here. Here she comes. Right to it. Guess what? They like the turkey grilled feast. The turkey is a hit. They haven't had wet food in like a week and they're just mowing it, macking it down. Well, how do we like it? How did we do? How do we do? Well, we did really good. They crushed it. It's a hit. It was a hit. Okay, so turkey feast and gravy grilled. That's on the list. Happy, beautiful fall Friday evening. The boys have settled down on their outdoor beds and we're just happy to hang out and be chill. And Heidi's happy not to appear on the vlog. Oh boy, yeah, you're right. looking beautiful. Because people were saying how gray you are. And Finn? Finn? Even you're gray. Even you're a little gray. And Magic, you're just looking like a stately middle-aged man, I hope. Aw. This has already been going on for two minutes, maybe. They finally settled down. So we're gonna have another intro session with Magic and Hemingway and Willow. And we're just gonna give them a little room to be able to step out on the front porch. Hi, kitties. Hi, kitties. Come on out. You stay. Finn, no. You wanna go see him, Magic? You wanna go see him? Okay. Hi, Okay, Magic, okay. It's okay. Yeah, Hemingway, the brave boy. Come here, buddy. You're okay. Magic's just curious. And Finn would be more than curious. Can't have two Great Danes at once dealing with these guys. Magic, come. Come. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're just saying hi. Relax. Be nice. Yes. Good kitty, good kitty, it's okay. It's okay, Hemingway. I know you don't love it, but hey, okay, okay. Not gonna hurt you. Well, that might hurt you, Magic. Wagging his tail, looking at your sister. I'm videoing this because it's the thing. Okay, here's Magic's turn for off-leash healing. Magic, sit. Sit. Good boy. Stay. I guess we're about 30 feet away from him now. He's bored. Magic, come. Good boy. Good boy. Magic, sit. There he did it. That's a good boy. Let's go to the lake, buddy. Or let's at least go down and pick up 
Finn's poop that I didn't have bags for when we were out. Let's go. Always pick up your poop, people. Come on. Here. There it is, guys. People ask me, like, how do you train them? Well, every walk is a training opportunity. And so, heel. You want to keep their shoulders in parallel with you. Heel. And if I was on the training collar, I would just give a, a tug and release and keep my, and then when I stop, he stops. Heel. And that's how you do it. Hello, everybody. A little time with Finn at the lake. Just Finn, no other dogs. And uh, see if we can get him to play fetch or something. And we'll see how it goes. Well, just in case Finn decides to go swimming, I thought I'd turn the video camera on. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Another beautiful Saturday afternoon here. People out by the lake, a little fishing. Finn checking out the water. Magic's at home. Just thought I'd get a little Finn time. What do you think? I think Finn would like to pay a fetch. Yeah, I think he would. Whoa, ready? Finn? Get it! Bring it here, get it! Come on, good boy! He's like a retriever. Come on, come here. Finn, get it, get it. Bring it here. Drop it, here, leave it, come here. Good boy, get it. Bring it here. Come. Leave it. Leave it. Okay. Ready? <clears throat> Bring it here. Good boy. Come. Get the ball. I don't think he's got a whole lot more interest, but two times. I don't think he's run. Hey, come here. Finn, ready? Ready? Finn, fetch it. Hey! Bring it here! Good boy. Sit! Sit! Hey! Good boy! <clears throat> he never gets it on the first try. Come on! Good boy! Okay, come. Drop it. Oh, good boy. Oh no, into the lake. All right, that'll do that. Come on, Finn, let's go. Finn, come. Come. Heel. No, would you? Finn, sit. What a good boy. What a good boy. What a good boy. Heel. Wow, good job, Finn. That was really, really good and I never gave him any stimulus. I just called him on verbal. Hey, Finn, come. Come. Good boy. He's off leash, he's listening. Finn, sit. Oh, there, he thought about it, but he did it. He's a good boy. Thanks for watching everything. Have a great day. Why can't every dog be just as good?